How do you think he's gonna do on Saturday? Okay, we are talking with Kara. Okay, we know the problem. You, you are seeing a quad and having a squad. We are talking with Gerard and Kara. You see the problem? Because Ben Ayun, Kone <laughs> Shai, you see the problem. But we are talking with him. We know we have quality, okay? We was talking with Hatramni. He's good for us. He was playing well with Gerard in central midfield. But we will see. It's okay for us. We will see good. the problem. So, Steve Gerard, man. Are you good that you're not playing on Saturday? Um, yeah, I am. Uh, you know, I think about the whole season so far. Um, you know, I just want to see how it goes. Um, I was talking with the manager. Uh, you know, I know it's been a difficult season so far, but just got to keep progressing. Uh, I'm just continue doing what I'm doing, and that's just playing well for Liverpool. But, uh, you know, I can't, I can't see any more than that. Uh, I'm just happy to, uh, to be playing for Liverpool. Fantastic. Do you know anyone? So, Jamie, um, what do you think about all these things coming out in the papers about you not being uh, patriotic or...? I can only say what, what, how I feel, you know, what, what, what I've been talking about it a few times. You know, you know the situation that was going now. I, I want to play for the club comes first, we said it, said it come, you know, time and time again. We see how it goes, see how we progress the season. But, you know, that, that's, that's the way I feel, the situation, you know. That's good, good. Anyone else? That's classic. Question. Uh, Michael Owen, how do you feel that you got left out of the England squad, mate? I mean, I'm only gonna be honest about it, you know, I'm, I'm disappointed, you know, <laughs> Cabello's a bit of a dickhead, really, when you think about it. <laughs> I just want to play football and get scoring goals, you know. I'm playing up front now, week in, week out, with Joel and Amy Obi, so, you know, things should be going a lot better than that, so, we'll see how it goes, so. Yeah, man. I'm disappointed. Thanks for the question, Mohammed. Okay. <laughs> Peter, how are you feeling life in Portsmouth? Yeah, it's, uh, you know, it's alright, you know, it's just been playing well, scoring goals, can't do no more than that, you know, <laughs> I was working well with Jermaine Defoe, you know, that's all I can do, that's, see how it progresses this season and then we'll, we'll develop that understanding then, but I'm happy playing under Harry Redknapp and doing what I'm doing best, you know? So David, I'm just wondering, how's life going with AC Milan? Yeah, um, you know, it's good, um, the kids are good, Victoria's good, everything's good. So, you know, all I can do, you know, is look forward, um, you know, because everything's good. So, you know, the, there's two women in my life, and, you know, Victoria and Gary Neville. Um, but they're in different parts of the world, so, you know, it's really difficult for me. But I love them to death. Um, I think, you know, um, obviously, you know, my, my future lies with, with one of my girls, and I think that's Gary. Um, you know, Gary hates scouses, but I love them. I love scouses, so, you know, but, um, yeah, mwah, mwah. <laughs> Rafael, last night was a very special night for Liverpool FC. So how are you feeling? I'm not feeling good because um, I have the flu, no? But uh, apart from that, it's a good result for us. So when we are working hard and you can see this product, it's okay when you are scoring goals because we scored in goal and they didn't score, so we won the game one day. So it's a good thing for us, man. So contract-wise, are you going to be here at Liverpool Football Club this season? Are you going to be signing a new contract or not? I will be signing a new contract. Um, the only problem for me is signing a new contract is which contract do I sign? I was thinking Vodafone because you can get the free weekend. <laughs> T-Mobile, no, because you can you can do a lot of things. You can get e e extra minutes, no. But I will definitely be signing a contract soon. But with Liverpool, I don't know. All right, Wayne. Um, I'm wondering, right? This girl gets out of my head. Once you said when you were there, and all oh, once a blue, always a blue. Did that actually mean anything to you? Um, you know, obviously, um, you know, I had a great, great career um, at Everton. Um, but um. You know, um, you know, Sir Alex has come in and he's made an offer. Um, you know, obviously, you know, money talks, doesn't it? Um, but um, no, it didn't mean anything. Um, and waiting to talk about Chelsea. Um, I'm a Chelsea fan. Was once a blue man, Chelsea. So I don't know what I don't know what the stuff is on about. <laughs> but are you still an Everton fan of heart? Um, no, as I say, you know, I'm a Chelsea fan. Yeah, so um, you know, the situation is, and um, you know, there's not really much much more to say than that. Um, but see, um, you know, I think um, situations obviously um, in sense at the minute um, with, with the Everton fans, but um, I love them all really. Um, I was happy. Um, obviously, it was great to, to get in the score sheet. Um, took a little bit of criticism this week. Um, I'm not too happy with that, but uh, you know, I've had great support from uh, the Liverpool fans and the England fans were good to me uh, the other night, so I'm really happy with that. I mean, to be honest with you, you know, I spoke about this a few times, you know. Uh, Okay, I can understand you asking the question, but you know, I'm, I'm slowly to Liverpool, you know, give me the opportunity when I was a young lad, and you know, I'm, I've, got, I've got to be loyal, you know, you know, I'd be happy with that, you know, I think um, Liverpool's a, a fantastic club, and I regret leaving them, to be honest with you, but you know, I've got to focus on, on scoring goals for Newcastle, I mean, you know, if the offer came to come back to Liverpool and snap it up, I think you know that, you know.
okay, we know it's a problem because we are talking with Torres and we know that he works hard for Spain, okay? I was talking with the manager, he has a problem. He has a problem. He has, okay, we are talking hamstring, something like this, but okay, we are thinking 10 days, we can see a problem, we will see, but we need to talk with the player and then we will decide Chelsea maybe, I don't know. And now for the World Cup then? Um, no, I can't wait for the World Cup. Um, la, um, but hopefully, um, you know, um, I don't have to um, do it on my own. Um, like I did for Manchester United last season. Um, uh, OK, thanks for that, Wayne. Good luck in the finals. It's Fabio thinks you want to play on a pitch with the lamppost in the way. You, you know, you can think again. Um, I want not to Kelsey. And also the news that Michael Ballack's injured. This bodes well for England, surely. Ballack's injured. I thought he was injured anyway, the way he's been playing, innit? Well, you know, Fabio's gonna say, screw Tom bringing me back, I think, you know. I don't think that McLaren was all there anyway, to be honest, you know, he thinks he's such now, apparently. I <laughs> see, but in terms of the World Cup, do you think we can contribute? Well, obviously we're gonna win the World Cup, and I'll just find the team, Scouts. Hope you're listening, big guys. Moving on, uh, Mr Capello is a great tactician. Well, for I think Fabio will play a 4 4 2 and flat because I don't know if you spite for the Spanish or the French. Do you think. Fa what? German! Yeah. I reckon we'll win it. Great. Thanks, Stevie G. I think we've got Frank Lampard coming up, so we don't want to miss that. And Lampard's better than me. That's like saying Scouts is like Gary Neville. Thanks, Stevie G. Jared, play your left next time. He plays me on the left, he plays me on the right. I think this Fabio fellow wants me to be Oki Koki. Yeah, I mean, uh, I think we know there's a, there's a bigger issue here than the, the game, don't we? I mean, you know, the question on, on everybody's lips is, you know, why have an ITV snapped up a national TV man like myself? I mean, it's... OK, that's great. Thank you, Michael. No problem, OK. How come you've been working, Gerard, so hard before the World Cup? I don't care. I'm not resting, Gerard. I couldn't care less about England. I'm Spanish. Oh, and Mr. Ferguson, if you are listening, Scotland are not in the World Cup. And that is a fact. That is all. Yeah, Rooney's a top player. Um, Rooney's got a good right foot, left foot, couldn't he? Uh, but he's very ugly. Just let me out on that bloody pitch, will you? I know you rely on me. I'm bloody great. <laughs>